Not so long ago, we got 12.6 under our Avid account. And there was a big issue. They sent us 12.6, but no license to run it. So a lot of you guys went, downloaded the software, and couldn't open it. And the problem with that is it removed the previous version. So now you have to waste all this time to uninstall, you know the rest. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys wrote to Avid, and within a day or two, you got your license. But this is what they sent you. If we go and we click on my Pro 2 subscription, we're going to see that it's a temporary license that they sent. Deposit it. 929 expiration 1028 and today is 1023 so you know what that means in a couple of days it's going to expire so if i don't do anything about this i won't be able to launch pro tools and that's why i'm making this video some of you guys out there probably didn't notice that they sent you a temporary license some of you guys out there actually have the full license and what i'm saying in this video doesn't matter to you but if you're one of those that had this issue and you got this temporary license i suggest you go to your iLock account click on your name so if you click on the available tab, you should have this here, Pro Tools Perpetual Bundle. And if we click this little drop down, you're going to have the perpetual license 12, 11, and 10. And this answers some of your questions. I believe one of my subscribers, Watchmen for You, had asked this question, will I lose my perpetual license? And the answer is no. If you have a perpetual license, they're not going to get rid of that. You own your copy of Pro Tools. What would happen if you stop paying the subscription, you're just going to stay with this version of Pro Tools. A couple of months and you decide to get back into it, they're going to charge you an arm and a leg. But as of right now, we own our version of Pro Tools. Some of you guys out there are renting it. And once you stop paying your yearly price, you won't have the ability to use Pro Tools whatsoever. As you can see, perpetual license, meaning we own it. So now all that's left, you want to activate this. So you can do this a couple of ways. You can drag this over to your iLock or you can right click and activate or control shift A. So let's do this. Let's activate. And as you can see, it's asking me to surrender my previous license. And that's fine. I am willing to do this. So I'm going to press complete and it's going to surrender my old license. If we take a look, license surrender successfully, the following license have been surrendered and it shows you that that's fine. So now I have to select a location. As you can see, it's the only location that's allowed, which is the iLock2 and I'm gonna press activate now. And it's asking you, do you wanna confirm? I'm just press okay. Now it's starting the transfer, starting to deposit those license to my iLock. Successful activation. Four licenses has successfully activated. So press OK and let's go to our iLock and let's look for this. Have you noticed that we still have the temporary license? They haven't removed that, but they're not going to. It's going to expire. If we take a look, we have the new license right here. So we can run 12, 11, and 10. Let's double click and let's check out the information that's here. As you can see, it was deposited on 10, 18. Uh, 2016, which was a couple of days ago, but I didn't want to do any of this without making a video. I wanted to show you guys the process because a lot of you guys still have questions on the iLock, how it works. Although I made a video on this, I still get the questions. I told myself, might as well, let's record a video on this. And at the same time, I wanted to let you guys know that there is a possibility if you don't look into this, you might not be able to launch your Pro Tools and you can't have that. Especially if you're making money out of it, you need to have your system up and running at all times so there you go that's how you do this if i confused any of you guys out there my apologies if you have any questions post in the bottom check the description there's going to be some information don't forget to like and if this is the first time watching one of my videos subscribe to the channel it's completely free this is ray and i'm out of here later guys